If you're a math teacher, you've hit this question. How can you make it stick? How can you make sure students get to the end of the school year and they're content area masters, not just masters of the last couple of weeks of school? Well, I have three favored solutions from my 20 years of teaching. Teach to concepts, not just process, if you want it to stick. Ensure student engagement, always be looking for ways to get students involved in the learning. And then finally, some kind of ongoing investment into mixed review. And that's why I wrote Get More Math, that third piece. You know, as a teacher, I could find ways to get kids engaged. I could really seek to connect to concepts. I could build a, a powerful curriculum, and I did, but I could still get to the end of the school year and discover that everything had sort of faded away. So the question is, why does that happen? And why does that happen in such a, a widespread fashion, like across the United States? Everybody I talk to says, oh yeah, mm -hmm, I forgot everything I learned in algebra. Well, why? Of course, there are many reasons. Uh, but one, one in particular that I want to focus on, is how people use their time, how, how teachers invest themselves and their minutes in a typical classroom. So generally speaking, the pattern in an American classroom is, let's have a lesson on new content, and then let's practice that content. Um, in my view, there's a piece that's missing there. To really get to it, let's just think about what's happening. Day one, let's learn a new thing, pra practice it some. Day two, learn a new thing, practice it some. Repeat process, take a unit test, start another unit. New thing, new thing, new thing, practice, practice, practice. Perhaps we mix in a little bit of, uh, maybe in warm-ups, some, some reach-back review, some spiral rev review. But the, the dominant emphasis is move forward, conquer new territory. Unfortunately, that's not a very brain-friendly approach. It's odd to me. We all know that. Nobody hears me say this and says, no, no, no. Kids, if they learn 180 lessons back to back to back to back, retain everything. Um, and yet, the... the the effort that it takes to retool your approach, how you invest minutes, is significant and perhaps even it seems too big of a barrier. Uh, it's not, I'm telling you, you can do it. I did it and it made a huge difference when instead of just teaching a new thing and practicing it, I added a third component. That is to say, I invested in mixed review every day. Get More Math provides daily sessions of cumulative mixed review, individualized to each student's needs. This way, the teacher can focus on teaching a lesson, and then Get More Math can provide practice of that lesson. But more importantly, Get More Math can begin to pull in problems that reach back to maybe a week before or a month before. Each student is receiving something that's particular to that student's data trail. Every day, the algorithm we have in the background is deciding what's the most important content for this student. Maybe something that she's not that good at yet, or maybe something that she was very good at two months ago but hey, let's bring it back on the screen, give her an opportunity to demonstrate that she still understands it, or perhaps discover she doesn't anymore and give her additional practice. We believe that the best instructor is a human instructor. The, the person who in interaction and dialogue with students is engaging young minds and ensuring that they're learning and connecting new concepts, new skills. What we do is we provide the backup as the teacher is pushing ahead lesson after lesson, the teacher can also have students log in to get more math and have daily cumulative mixed review sessions. These sessions keep reaching back to content from prior weeks, from prior months, so that as the teacher's going ahead, we're pushing back and making sure that the, the body of content is building up and students are gradually attaining content area mastery. The vision is for the teacher to arrive with the classroom at the end of the school year and have all the key skills and concepts still in place, still in the brain. If you're interested in using Get More Math at your school, check out our website. We have information there about a free school-wide pilot that lasts throughout the entire school year.